How many of you in our audience made a New Year's resolution for real, like a real one? <laughs> Nobody? <laughs> Well, you know, the tradition of making New Year's resolutions began more than 4,000 years ago in ancient Babylon uh, as a way to encourage Babylonians to purchase gym memberships they would never use. <laughs> True. Most people lose interest in their resolutions and give up by January 8th. But for me, I think it's a matter of self-esteem. If you're happy with yourself, you don't feel the need to make resolutions. So we sent my cousin Sal out on the street today to yell compliments at people walking by, ask them to shout nice things in an aggressive way, and as you will see here, I think he really helped to boost their self-esteem. Hey, let me ask you something. Was your New Year's resolution to get in the best shape of your life? Because you clearly succeeded, all right? Yeah, you got muscles on your muscles. Yeah, you're welcome. That's about it. Excuse me, let me see something. Your nail beds are so healthy and well cared for. Your manicurist must be very proud, right? <laughs> very proud. Hey, let me ask you something. You exfoliate because you have perfect skin. You ever heard that before? Oh, I have actually heard that. You have? Who told you that? Because that person's a genius. Yeah, me and others, right? Congratulations on the skin. Oh, look, my Yeah, give me a hug. <laughs> let me rub it up against that skin. Oh, nice. Beautiful. Hey, sir, was your New Year's resolution to have the best-looking family ever? You must be so proud of your beautiful family, right? Aren't you so proud? I'm very proud. Oh, uh, you must be. You must have the best family holiday cards, right? I'd like one if you have an extra. Hey, you know what? You should be a runway model because you have a real impressive strut. You really have that walking thing down to a T. You must walk all the time. And your eyes are so symmetrical, too. Perfect distance apart. Yeah, you're like the opposite of a Picasso painting. And I like your wings. Hey, you have really long eyelashes. Do you jump rope with those eyelashes? You probably do, because you're so in shape. I'm sure you do, that's how you stay so fit. Am I right? Hey, man, you're really self-confident with the ponytail with the shirt off. I wish I had that confidence. I know. Oh, I know, and you do. Hey, let me ask you something. Did you fall from heaven? Because your legs are really strong. They probably just got like that and you landed on them. Because you have strong legs. You're a muscular guy. Right? You better believe it. Yeah. That's it. Strong guy. Yeah. Kick my ass. For sure you'd kick my ass. You better believe it. You better believe it. That's what I'm saying to you. Right? Hey, that's a great megaphone. I wish I had a megaphone like that. Can I use that? I just scream all day, and I don't have anything to amplify it. I got a raspy voice at the end of the day, but not you. You thought ahead. Really smart. And you're friends with Jesus. Hey, why are you running, man? You already have the perfect physique. What are you doing? What? I'm running. I know, why? Why, because I'm running. You look perfect already. It's OK. Don't tell me. You don't need to run. You look perfect, all right? It's okay. Cut out the running. No, Just cut it out. Right. You look right. great. It's OK. You but look it's great. My, it's my problem. It's your problem. You look great. OK, but don't I'm, give me Hey, I'm telling you, you look great. Don't tell me anything. You look great, all right? I don't care what you say. Stop running. You look great. You look great. Yeah. Take a compliment. We're very nicely done. Your beard sir. is like a testosterone forest. Uh, Any you. woman would like to dive into hey, it. Get him out of here. Get out. That's cousin Sal. Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel. Did you know there are things other than pornography on the internet? Watch them on the Jimmy Kimmel Live YouTube channel, which, much like your own body, I encourage you to explore.